Get over here, I need help cleaning the wall. Oh, you're busy? That, that's fine. You do you, yeah. I don't need your help because I've got help right here. It's called Chemical. Don't worry, you didn't just get clickbaited. One of the products I actually tested here today crushed, crushed the rest of the group. It made cleaning my house super easy. So if you just wanna know what that product is, there'll be a link right down below to Amazon. You can select that. Though, I tell you, learning how and seeing how I actually tested is kinda cool, so you can watch that as well. Now there's something I wanna tell you before we start this video, and that is if you're getting your house power washed, there's a good chance whoever is doing it is actually using some of these chemicals or something like this to assist. Like power washing just using pressure is hard. Power washing using chemicals, tons easier. So I know all these bottles look different. They try to catch your attention in the aisle, so you think this one's gonna work better than the other. But the bottom line is they're basically using all the same chemical. It's called sodium hypochlorite. So sodium hypochlorite is, you guessed it, it's bleach and the stuff works really good at cleaning all that moldy crap from our home. So the first cleaner we're checking out today is this 30 seconds outdoor cleaner house deck and fence. You can see this has an attachment to hook right up to a hose, which is really convenient. Now in the back here, when we're talking about the chemicals, you can see we got sodium hypochlorite bleach and it's got 8% of that, which is the highest concentration of all the cleaners. So here's the next cleaner we're looking at today. This is called 30 Seconds Outdoor Cleaner Concentrate. This is different from the other one because this is a mix yourself. Now they do recommend a one-to-one -one mixture, meaning one part this, one part water. And let's look at the chemicals in here. Unlike the other one, the sodium hypochlorite, and this one's only 5%. So the next cleaner we're looking at today is right here. This is called Mold Armor. This is easy house wash. This stuff's really popular. You see this all over Home Depot. And so let's look at the chemical ingredients in this one. You can see we're talking about sodium hypochlorite being 5.25%. So next up, we have the good old reliable Clorox bleach. Now they do have some mixing instructions on the side. Now let's look at the active ingredients here. So our sodium hypochlorite is 7.55%. So of course, Clorox does have a product made for outdoor cleaning. Now this is a little bit of a dark horse. And the reason why is they actually tell you what chemicals are included, but not what percentages. So today we've got a simple test plan. We're gonna spray all five of these in a test area and see which one cleans the best. So I just let the areas wait about 15 minutes. Let's go over them all. First off, we have the 30 second uh, garden hose panel right here. This is the test area. Next up, we have the mold armor. This is the hose connection right there. Next up is the 30 second regular bottle. This is the concentrate mix. We have the outdoor Clorox uh, concentrate right here. And lastly, we have the regular Clorox panel right here. So the results are really good because we can definitely eliminate one as a well-performing cleaner and that is the armor, the mold armor right here. I'm surprised by this but you can see the area still has lots of mold in it uh, up top here in the middle there's lots of mold so I'm really not impressed with that. My favorite panel though <laughs> oddly enough, is the 30 second outdoor cleaner water hose right here. Look how clean this is. It is perfectly clean all the way down. This did a great job. Let's go over to the concentrate area. In the concentrate area, we have the 30 second bottle right here. It's pretty clean. Let's go over to the Clorox outdoor. I don't know if I can tell any difference there at all. Uh, maybe down here, the 30 second did better than the, uh, the Clorox Outdoor did over here. There's just a little bit of mold left right here. And lastly, we've got regular Clorox. This is the indoor stuff. Um, I used it straight, so there was no mixing. Uh, the fact that the 30 second Outdoor actually has the most amount of bleach in it, it's got 8%. It definitely performed the best. It cleaned further. Check it out, it even dripped down the bottom there. That's where you can really tell the difference in performance. 
Uh, if we're going to go by that, the Cloroxes both did well as uh, also the 30 second outdoor didn't do as well. So there's our winner right there, guys. This is the product to get if you want to clean your house and not use a power washer, just wash it down. You should get rid of your mold. And that's exactly what we're going to do next. I'm actually going to test this on this whole wall and see if we can get this thing cleaned up. Well, this is absolutely a first for Kite Army. The product that actually won the test is going to be the easiest to apply. The reason why is all you need to do is connect a hose up to it, spray your wall, let the chemicals do the work. And the cool thing about this is you don't need a ladder, you don't need a pressure washer. All you need is 15 minutes and hopefully you'll have a tidy, perfectly mold-free clean wall. You can't argue with those results. Look how clean that is. This is where my test area was before. All I did was spray it, guys, that's it. So there'll be a link to this product down below. I'm actually shocked to be recommending something to you, but this stuff works, so there's a link right down below on Amazon. It seems pretty cheap. Uh, to give you an idea of what kind of coverage you can get, I did this whole wall very generously with one bottle, so you're probably gonna need to buy two bottles at least to get a house done. I could have probably done twice the amount of surface area, but I was just like coating it on. So all in all, that is a great result, and I'm stoked to be able to share that with you. I didn't expect it. So anyway, at this point, please make sure you like this video, subscribe to my channel, leave a comment down below about what kind of cleaners you use on your house. I love to hear from you, and don't go anywhere because there's an awesome video, not that side, it's right there, guys. Let's head over there.